Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is going to be for the week of February 15th through the 21st. Now, keep in mind the timing is still fluid, and not every reading is for you, so this reading may not be for you. I'm going to do it a little bit different this time. I'm going to be doing you and another person. This other person is going to be somebody that is predominantly in your energy. It may not be who you think it is. You'll be able to figure out who it is. Um, so what do we have for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of February 15th through the 21st? What do we have for Aries? What do we have for Aries? Justice. So justice. Justice is a card of a decision that is being made. Maybe a final decision is being made. It is getting what you deserve. Balance being restored. Something turning out in your favor. Getting what you deserve. So you're going to be getting what you deserve this week. And some sort of balance or truth may be coming out. I feel like you are in your integrity. I feel like you are making some sort of decision this week. It's a final decision of some sort. Justice is going to be served. Truth is on your side. Everything, Something is going to go in your favor. Page of Pentacles. Now, the Page of Pentacles is a solid, stable opportunity, a new prospect, a new endeavor, a new doorway that is opening up. So a new doorway is going to be opening, and opening up for you. You're going to be getting an opportunity. It's not going to be easy. Whatever this opportunity is that you are receiving to start something, you're, this is like a starting something new. So you're going to be going down a new path. It's not going to be easy. You're going to have to focus. It's, you're going to have to put in effort. This leads to long-term stability. So whatever it is that you are receiving, this is a card of karma, okay? And so and it looks like it's good to me. It feels like you're going to be receiving a golden opportunity that can bring you something. It can bring you some sort of financial stability or security. But you're going to have to put in some sort of work and you're going to have to make a decision to put in the work. So you're going to have to make some sort of... Uh, big decision this this week um this is an opportunity that you deserve okay um what about the other person let's talk about whoever it is that's in your energy um you've manifested something you've manifested something that Maybe it's money or, or something like that. It doesn't have to be money. Whatever it is, it's something you can touch. You've, you're going to be receiving something. And it's going to bring, bring balance to your life. Oh, you could be dealing with a Virgo. could be dealing with a Taurus, Capricorn, even a Libra. Um, but whoever you're dealing with on this side is stuck. They are stuck. They are not very awakened. They're not very enlightened. Uh, they're feeling very lonely. They're isolated. You're dealing with somebody that um, they may be keeping you stuck. They may be keeping you stuck. Page, two of Wands. I don't know why I was going to say Page of Wands. Two of Wands reversed is indecisiveness, stuck in the present, unwilling to remove an obstacle. Somebody is, is uh, choosing to stay. Whoever you're dealing with is facing an obstacle they're facing some sort of blockage and they're unwilling to remove the blockage this is somebody that is not very awakened okay they're not very consciously aware they're, they don't have any long-term goal or something like that um, hmm. One more card regarding this person that you are dealing with. Whoever you're dealing with may be going through some sort of midlife crisis. Um, they need to make a decision, but they can't, or they're stuck, or they're at this crossroads. There's something blocking their success. It's their lack of conscious awareness. Whoever you're dealing with isn't very aware. Um, oh, my God. They're blocking you. You are dealing with somebody that is blocking you in some way. This is somebody that um, wants control. They want the lead. They want the. They want your position or something like that. You know, somebody you're dealing with somebody that is inexperienced, that is mean spirited, that may be narcissistic. 
This is somebody that is very, very controlling. They don't want you to be in control. They want to be in control. Um, I do see you going down a new path, though. You're going to be going down a new path. Somebody's trying to take your energy or they're trying to steal your energy. Um, they're trying to bring you down. They may be even trying to make you mad. They may be pushing your buttons. Um, hmm. May have something to do with a father or a husband or somebody that is just in a masculine energy. This is somebody that is definitely controlling. They may be even on the wrong side of the law. This is a tyrant of some sort. So you are dealing with somebody that, oh, that is for you. You're dealing with somebody that is, uh, I feel like they're narcissistic. Um, all right, and this is for the other person. So we got one for you, two for them. So for you on your side, discord among friends or family. So you may be dealing with discord this week. There could be a, a legal uh, news of a, a legal uh, situation this week. Um, news of legalities. There is, and it could have to do with a family member. But anyway, justice is going to be served, and everything is going to turn out as it should. Now, let's talk about over here. We got somebody over here that is very, very controlling, that doesn't have any long-term plan, that can't, that isn't very awakened, that is, um, I don't know, I feel like this person is, doesn't deal with obstacles. They may just retreat from obstacles. They don't, they don't find ways to overcome obstacles. And they probably get angry when there is an obstacle, whoever you're dealing with. When there's an obstacle in the way, this person probably retreats and doesn't even do anything. Or they act in an angry manner. Anyhow, a goal-oriented person. Interesting. Carrot, opportunity or windfall. So whoever this person is, is looking for an opportunity. They're looking for a windfall. It says that this person is goal-oriented. It's interesting that I just got, before I even looked at that card, I said this person doesn't have goals, doesn't set goals, doesn't follow through. I don't, I didn't say that, but that's what I'm thinking. Whoever this person is looking, this person is looking for something. There could be a sudden decision that is made with the two of wands reversed. But there's a lack of, a, of awareness with the hermit reverse. We have somebody that needs to go within. They need an attitude adjustment. They're stuck. They're trapped. So that's very interested. Who is this person? I don't feel like it's you. I don't feel like it's you. I feel like you're dealing with somebody who is very, very controlling. And uh, I feel like they're struggling. I feel like they're struggling to open up. You know, they're struggling to open up. They need to go within but they don't want to go within. They don't want to deal with any type of opposition. It's easier just to fight. Um, two of Pentacles. So this is a juggler. It's a player of some sort. A change is needed. Somebody may be changing their mind. They may be changing their mind. Maybe this person's been angry. Maybe they've become enlightened. I don't think so. I don't know. I don't, I don't think so. Maybe. Anyway, the Two of Pentacles is some sort of change. Somebody has been missing the boat. They've been playing games. They've been juggling. They've been trying to do too much. Um, I feel like we have somebody here that is really, really angry. They're, angry. they're angry that they missed the boat, but they missed the boat because they were playing games. You know, they weren't dealing with obstacles. They weren't aware that they needed to jump on board when it was time. Hmm. Ooh, an obstacle is being removed. Unbelievable. Now, it's interesting. Maybe this, so this person has been, you know, not seeing something. So whoever you're dealing with wasn't seeing, but there's about to be a change of some sort. This person may be, come, may, may be becoming goal-oriented. They've been in a place where they've been restricting themselves. They were wearing a blindfold. They were refusing to escape some sort of mentality. But there's a change here. There is a change. So somebody may be changing their thoughts. They're re they're, they're, they are removing an obstacle that has been in their way for a long time. Now there's, they're going to be giving you an opportunity. There's the opportunity. So you're going to be receiving an opportunity for somebody that may have deserted you in the time of need. This person may have abused you or neglected you or rejected you or something. There's, you're going to be receiving, and I don't know, it could be a boss, could be a father, could be, 
it could be anybody, somebody that is definitely um, likes to be in control and doesn't like to give up the power. I feel like this person is going through some sort of shift. Maybe it's a shift of awareness and now they're removing an obstacle and their obstacle may have been fear or it could have been some sort of thoughts, the way they were thinking, some sort of mentality. Something is changing within this person and they're, and they're ready to remove an obstacle. They are going to be, re and they've been lying. Maybe they've been lying to themselves, you know. Um, they haven't been aware. Maybe now they want to reconnect. Maybe they've, be, they've become enlightened in some way. You're going to be getting what you deserve. You're going to be getting an opportunity from somebody. You are. Um, maybe a friend or a family member. What, are we, what about Aries? Aries is going to be receiving justice. You're going to be receiving something. And you're going to have to make a decision whether you want to go down this path or not. It's not, you know, you are going to have to make a decision. Oh, my God. You're definitely receiving an offer from somebody, an opportunity. Everything is going to turn out as it should. For some of you, you're dealing with an uh, earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could also be dealing with a Libra. Um, you could also be dealing with an Aries or a Virgo. Anyhow, and it could be moon sun or rising signs but either way you're going to be receiving something that you can take to the bank okay this is something that can last and this is goals okay and i feel like you've been goal oriented and i feel like you have manifested something um you definitely have manifested something you're probably going to be laying a new foundation it's going to you're going to be working really really hard to learn some new things. You may need to learn some new skills. I think you will be um, building something solid. And it's going to take time. It's going to take time. But I think that you've earned it. I feel I feel like you have a lot of integrity. I feel like you... Um, I feel like you've earned something. You have earned something. So you're going to be receiving something that is of value from this person over here. Um, I see that you're stable, you're secure, you are, you act with integrity, so that's why you're going to be receiving this, whatever it is. Feels like some sort of hard work is about to pay off for you. This, for some of you, it could be a new business venture, signing a contract. <coughs> Somebody may be signing a new contract. That has to do with the, you know, it's laying a new foundation. So I think that you, for some of you, you're going to be signing a new contract. Ah, same spot. Interesting. So you're def there is definitely a change here. There is. You're going to be making a decision. Somebody's going to be presenting you with a choice. You're going to have to make a decision. This, this is something that you're going to have to sign. You're going to be signing something. <coughs> If not, it could be like a virtual thing. But anyway, um, this is a big, big, it's a decision. And it's, it has to do with a financial decision. It has to do with stability and security. So you're going to be making some sort of decision that has to do with your financial stability or your financial stability. Um, did I just say that? Security, stability. It has to do with friends or family. There's going to be some sort of change. Things are about to change. And it may be a little chaotic. You may you may feel like this is too much, you know, this may but I feel like you're gonna need to be flexible. And this person is becoming more flexible. So I do feel like somebody, whoever you're dealing with, is 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 becoming more flexible. They're removing some sort of obstacle. Maybe it's just their thoughts. And they're gonna be making a offer to you, or you're gonna be getting an offer, and there's gonna need you're gonna need to be flexible, put it that way. Um Oh my gosh, there's going to be some sort of union, there's going to be a partnership, there's going to be some coming together with another person. You're going to be uniting with somebody that you are very, very compatible with. You're going to be working with somebody, okay, uh, where there's some sort of deep connection. This is a perfect match of some sort. You're going to be matched up with somebody that you are probably meant to work with. I feel like you earned this, whether it's a job or it's a lover, okay? You're going to be connecting with somebody that um, you are, are definitely compatible with. Um, so, yeah, this is definitely a connection. Balance, you're about to receive some sort of opportunity that leads to unity in some way. You know, there's, there's some sort of union here that could last forever. It really could with these pentacles. This is something, it would take a lot of hard work. 
and and it will take a lot of perseverance and flexibility but it can absolutely positively work out this is this is something turning out in your favor okay something is going to turn out in your favor you're going to get exactly what you deserve um but I do. I feel like it has to do with friends or family. You're, this could even be a reunion with somebody. It could be a friend. It could be a family member. You know, where things just come together. Somebody, somebody may even be apologizing to you. The Page of Pentacles can be apology. It could be. Anyhow, I do believe whoever you are dealing with is removing an obstacle, or an obstacle has been removed. Maybe it's anger. Maybe it's. Um, a lack of awareness. Maybe this person has become aware. Maybe they went inside and thought about things and now they've thought about their anger or they thought about an obstacle and they're wanting to uh, be free. You know, maybe somebody just wants to be free. Maybe they're changing. Somebody's changing their mind. They're changing their mind about something and they're giving you an offer this week. Good luck. <laughs> 